<laughs> Coming to the stage now uh, is Laughology's president or ex-president <laughs> of the USCSB alumni. You might have seen her on Funny or Die. Everybody make some noise for the very funny Fiona Reedy. Netrunner, which is a game I don't even like. 
And then he was like, okay, well, not that, but do you want to go back to your place and, like, fool around? And I'm like, what do you mean? He's like, you want to go back to your place and do stuff? And I was like, what do you mean? And he's like, can we have sex? And I said, what is that? <laughs> <laughs> and he said, no. And I said, no, what is that? <laughs> And then he explained to me what sex was. <laughs> and then at the end of it, he said, so, can we? <laughs> and I was like, oh, nah. <laughs> and then he stood next to me awkwardly. And then I said, you don't have to pretend you came over here for more than just sex. And he said, thank you. <laughs> So if you want to know how much fun I am at parties. Uh, I went to another party once, I got the aux cord and um, thought it'd be fun to cue up the, the uh, the Seinfeld theme song that ended the party. Do you know how rude it is to go to someone else's party and end it for them? Everyone left. Oh my god, uh, I really fucking hate sex though. <laughs> <laughs> Very relatable to this horny college crowd. Uh, I fucking hate sex. It's just repetitive. I'm mostly just waiting for it to be over, and no matter how much I beg a man, he'll never hit me as hard as my family did. <laughs> Let's talk about puppies. Um, I always think it's cool how people who own pets, they always say they end up looking like their pets, you know? Uh, or at least acting like them. Like how horse owners, they always have the long hair, they put it in braids, and they always have feces stuck in it from the shit they rolled in. <laughs> Cat owners, they leave their hair everywhere, and they smell like they shit in a box and were too lazy to cover it up. <laughs> you know it's true. <laughs> Turtle owners, they're really shy, quiet, but they chew with their mouth open and they're very difficult to stab in the back. <laughs> I think that is cool that pets are like that. That's why I want to go down to the pound and I want to get me a really sexy dog. <laughs> oh, no one likes bestiality. <laughs> That's okay, we're doing it anyway. Um, you guys know, oh, <laughs> thank you sir, oh. Uh, Y'all know what makes a dog sexy? No, you're normal. I spent hours thinking about it. I want a dog with one ear up, one ear down. That way you know he's listening to you, but he's not too attentive. You don't want a man who remembers your birthday. That's psychopath shit. Mind your own fucking business. Oh. I want a dog because at least he'll learn no means no because it hurts when I hit him. I didn't want to tell that joke in front of a college crowd. But it happened anyway. <laughs> Sucks to suck. Um, I'm a really good person. No one believes that here now. <laughs> you guys are like, fuck yourself. I'm a really good person. Uh, I can tell you why. I was walking around uh, late Saturday night and I helped some people. Uh, I saw a couple really drunk girls uh, and they were just trying to get home. And I helped them. I walked over to their car, leaned in, blew into the breathalyzer, their car started up and they went home. <laughs> All right. Uh, I just wanted to say, um, are you guys ready? No? What's that finger? You're good. You're good? Okay. Uh, can we please stop hating trans people for being trans? Woo! And just hate them for being women? <laughs> <laughs>